Hi, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. Today I have the split shoe from Kent CNC to show you. They typically make items for um, larger industrial and production line um, CNC machines, but uh, with the popularity of the X-Carve and uh, everybody's ability to have a nice little home unit like this, they're starting to make some of these dust shoes. And this one in particular fits the DeWalt 611 hand router and a palm router. And if you've ever used a router before or a CNC machine, if you have, don't have a dust collection system on it, you're going to have dust and particles everywhere. And with this system, when I first started off with it, I didn't have any dust collection. And my best bet to keep it down was stand here with a hose from a shop vac the whole time and follow it. Unfortunately, some of these projects can take two and three hours to complete, and no one wants to stand there. So once I got this unit, it is like heaven because... Quite honestly, it's simple and it's really effective. Um, basically with a, the dust shoe like this, your router is going to go in through this hole and I'll show you in a minute. And it's going to ride on the router. Your hose is going to come off to the dust collection system. And these bristles are going to keep right at the ground, right at your work surface level. And the purpose of that is making sure all your suction stays right here and all your dust is contained. Um, really nice. and. This unit especially, they put a lot of thought into it. Now, comes apart, and there's basically three, three rare earth magnets in here, and you can't put this on backwards because there's three holes, two on one side, one on the other, and same with the magnets. So they line right up and click together. And that's really nice because, let's say if you've got your router bit on right now, you can slide your dust collector over it, slide it up into place. You can actually slide this underneath and it's connected. Super easy, super quick. Once your router comes down, this will be riding on your work surface, which is a two inch bristle on there. It works spectacular. Then all you have to do is tighten this, tighten this bolt down, which basically snugs this unit around the base, around your router and you're ready to go. Now, I've used this several times and I love it. Um, the only thing I guess suggest is if you're going to use a small shop vac, um, you can't let this thing run for a couple hours and then come back and expect the, uh, the shop vac to still be running because your, your vacuum cleaner isn't meant to run for that long. So I suggest if you're going to use a small one like myself, you run it for maybe a half an hour, shut it down or switch shop vacs if you've got more than one. If you've got a larger four inch dust collection system, and you step it down to this two and a quarter, um, I, you'd have to look at the load rating on it, whether or not you can run it that long. But great little product. I'm going to go ahead and um, do a project right now, which I know is going to be about three hours long. And uh, it really, really keeps down the dust in the air, which can be just terrible in a shop. So if you're looking for something like this for your X-Carve, look at Kent CNC, um, check them up on the web. Give them a call, whatever you need, if you want one. A uh, really nice other thing is this acrylic on the top is see-through. So with the light from the DeWalt 611 on the work surface, you can actually look through here and see what's happening. Really cool. And uh, this is just one thing that took this X-Carve and put it over the top is, is like super cool. So until next time, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. Come over and take a look at our... Um, YouTube videos, give subscribe, give us some likes. Stop over at the forum. Let's talk some tools. Talk about CNCs if you want. Um, show us your projects. We love seeing projects. So, and take a look at our giveaways that we've got going on. And until next time, I'm John from WorkshopAddict.com. Talk to you later.